our time here draws to a close. As it should. Sometimes even I feel the ascension. The doubt is a flaw of the flesh. Soon we shall know for a doubt. All will be known as sure and pure. You mean the machine god speaks in numbers? Tonight is only the beginning. That ship is one zero one one. For that one, zero one zero zero.
Initiated. Access granted. Who's here? What's going on out there? I told you I was not to be dist- Oh my. Come in. Come in and let me see you. How did you get in here? And how did you know to come now? Tonight of all nights, when we are finally ready to answer the call of the Machine God's infinite wisdom. Surely, your arrival here is not coincidental. I'm looking for Alison Stanek. <laughs> of course you are. And you have found her on the eve of her greatest achievement. But do you seek counsel? Assistance in your prayers or meditations? Or are you here to join us? To free yourself from this prison of flesh and give yourself to the glory of the singularity. If there is any way your High Priestess can be of assistance to you, I am more than happy to provide. I want to ask you about the bombs you built for the attack on Ruzika Station. Is that all? My augmented brother Victor is a brave man. The great leader. When he asked me to build some of my little ones for him, I was proud to accept. I know Victor. If he's behind these attacks, I'd like to have a talk with him. After our flesh flood oppressors sent one of their dogs to murder Talos Racker, Victor moved his base of operations to a research center in the Swiss Alps. Garm, I believe it is called. Garm? Okay, I got it. That is why you came here? You entered this sacred place to solicit my help against Victor's holy revolution? Freak! Blasphemer! And I believed you were one of us. I am. I just have a more inclusive idea of who us is. <laughs> then you have become their willing slave. But not I. I have felt the boots of the police as they spat on me and mocked me for who I was. I could have lain down, like you, but I persevered, and the Machine God has given me my reward. I emerged from the Crucible enlightened. Your father told me you were once a soldier, a defender of innocent people. Now you help murderers. You need to find yourself again. You've let them turn you into someone you're not. Who the fuck are you to tell me who I should be? You do not get to decide that! 
I have had enough taken from me! All the augmented have. Only when the last throat of the flesh flood has been slit, and their filthy blood overflows the sewers of the world, will they have gotten what they deserve. That's a great idea. Murder more innocents. That'll really help convince everyone that Augs are decent people who can be trusted not to go crazy and hurt anybody. You arrogant, patronizing fuck! I hope Victor's next attack blows you to pieces. His next one? Of course. I gave him enough of my little ones to bring the entire city to rubble. So go, and join a pro-decommissioning rally. Or any other event with poor security. Hey, we're not done here. Allison? Oh, shit. It is time, children. It's time now. The body is the prison. Augmentations are the key. The consciousness is all. Cast off the bounds of flesh and blood. Embrace the singularity. Allison, stop! I know what you're doing. I've seen this kind of tech before. It ended badly. Your ignorance of your own people is contemptible. This is the ascension. Only our bodies will die. Our minds will leave this corporeal shell and merge with the divine consciousness of the machine god. I'm more interested in preventing another attack. What's Victor's next target? I didn't bother asking him. I am going to leave you and all the pathetic concerns of this physical plane far behind. To become one with the Machine God is to enter an entirely new existence. You're not leaving your concerns behind. Your thoughts and memories are an inextricable part of your mind. So when you go, everything you've lived through will come with you. Yes. You are right. I must have faith that perhaps beyond this, the agony I have suffered through will matter less. All we can do in this world is struggle, suffer, and then die. Such a life is meaningless. If you open your eyes, you will see the truth behind this horror. The Ascension is the only thing that will deliver us. Not the only thing. No matter what, you've always been able to count on your father. If you wanted to, you could leave here right now and go live with him. He'd take care of you and show you that not everything in this world is without merit. You think I have not considered this? He is a good man, but I will not make his burdens any heavier by forcing him to cope with my struggles as well as his own. Goodbye, my ignorant, deluded brother. I hope someday you do become enlightened and I see you on the other side. But I doubt it! No, I'll stop it.
Smiley, notify the state police. We need a coroner and a cleanup crew in the Prokaska district. Jesus, Jensen, is this about the bomb maker? Nomad Stanek slipped his escort. I know. His daughter was messed up. Bomb maker and high priestess rolled into one. Where's Miller? Flying back to Prague now. Want me to update him? Just tell him this is bigger than we thought. And have him wait for me at Chicane's place. Jensen out. Aria, I just heard what happened. God, right outside your apartment? What happened outside my apartment? Someone got all their implants torn out, was left to bleed to death in the alley. When I first heard where it was, I thought... I'm fine, Aria. It wasn't me. Be careful going home. It's not the first one of these I've heard about. Can't even trust the department. Don't see that much anymore. I'll quit. That's all. Who else will take care of it? So you found the bomb maker, linked everything to I. Not exactly. Jesus, Jensen. We did find the bomb maker. Her name was Allison Stanek. She was... Was? Well, Jensen, you sure do leave a lot of past tense in your wake. I didn't kill her. 
She was mixed up with the Church of the Machine God. Called herself their High Priestess. And before she ended her own life, she told me she'd made dozens more bombs, which she then delivered to Viktor Marchenko. So it was Ark? A splinter faction inside Ark. I'm telling you, Miller, something more is going on here. Stanek told me Marchenko has a base of operations in the Swiss Alps, a research facility called Garum. That sound like something Ark has the resources for to you? I'll contact McCready. Get him and a few analysts to work up a plan. We need to move on this now. Chicane and I can fly there and back, get a lay of the land, while Mac and his team do the research. Really? Got it all figured out in that clockwork head of yours. Oh, what the hell? I'm in. You got enough fuel to get to Switzerland? To get us there, sure. Fine, do it. But this is recon only. Do not engage. Contact me the minute you have something. Yes, sir. You've proven yourself so far on this one, Jensen. Don't screw it up. Tell me that. Miller is not used to giving compliments, is he? He's getting static from the brass. They're starting to riot in Gollum over that shit with Rucker. I'm sure he doesn't blame you. Much. Anymore. And what do you think? I think tracking that bomb maker was some fine work. If the intel you got from her stands true, Gollum City will be the least of our problems. So what do you say we go find out how deep in it we are, right? You all set? Hey, when we get to the Alps, we could get into some action. Are you ready for that? Why? Because I've been flying hack for the last few years. That's the thing about us naturals, Jensen. We never rust. <laughs> Look. I've been doing this a long time. Been in my share of shit, too. Always managed to pull myself out of it. Fair enough. Just don't leave without me. Hey, listen up. I know we're not exactly pals, and I know I can be an asshole. But I'm not a fucking asshole. In fact, I'm offended you'd even say something like that. That's not what I meant. I'm just messing with you, Jensen. <laughs> you ready? Yeah, fire it up. Gum just popped up on radar. I'll keep us beyond visual range and engage DRFM jamming. Scan the facility from the air with negative. I'm gonna find out what's being planned. I gotta get inside. You crazy? We have no way of knowing what's in there. I'm tired of flying this limousine around. Did you say you wanted to get back in the action? Fine. I'm not setting us down.